Father God, we just thank you so much for an opportunity to be in your presence. Once again, we thank you, Father, for this brand new day that you've made. And Lord, we do rejoice and we are glad in it. Father, we thank you so much for the worship time, Lord. We thank you for touching each one of our hearts, oh God. We thank yes, you Lord. for touching us and renewing our mind. So we pray, Father, for the word as it comes forth, that it may be for your glory and for your will, Lord, for transformation to come and restoration. We thank you, Lord, for it. So I pray, Holy Spirit, that you be in charge of this teaching today, Lord, that you will be glorified through everything that is spoken. Let the words of my mouth and the meditation of my heart be acceptable in thy sight. O oh Lord, my strength and my redeemer. Amen. 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 We've been studying the book of John, and it has been an exciting study time. Mm -hmm. Even on this past Tuesday, we decided to look at uh, excerpts of the Passion of the Christ just to yeah. bring us into focus as to what was going on. And as we got to the end, we didn't do chapter 21. So I really believe that God would have me to share some things concerning John chapter 21. And I thought, first of all, that I would just read the chapter. So I'm going to read it from the King James Version. You can follow along with me if you want to. You can read it with me if you want. We have King James. But it's John chapter 21. And it says, After these things, Jesus showed himself again to the disciples at the Sea of Tiberias. And on this wise showed he himself. There were together Simon Peter and Thomas called Didymus and Nathaniel of Cana in Galilee and the sons of Zebedee and two other of his disciples. Simon Peter saith unto them, I go a fishing. They say unto him, We also go with thee. <laughs> they went forth and entered into a ship immediately, and that night they caught nothing. But when the morning was now come, Jesus stood on the shore, but the disciples knew not that it was Jesus. Then Jesus saith unto them, Children, have ye any meat? They answered him, No. And he said unto them, Cast the net on the right side of the ship, and ye shall find. They cast therefore, and now they were not able to draw it for the multitude of fishes. Therefore that disciple whom Jesus loved saith unto Peter, It is the Lord. Now when Simon Peter heard that it was the Lord, he girt his fisher's coat unto him, for he was naked, and did cast himself into the sea. And the other disciples came in a little ship, for they were not far from land, but as it were two hundred cubits, dragging the net with fishes. As soon then as they were come to land, they saw a fire of coals there, and fish laid thereon, and bread. Jesus saith unto them, Bring of the fish which ye have now caught. Simon Peter went up and drew the net to land full of great fishes, and hundred and fifty and three. And for all there were so many, yet was not the net broken. Jesus saith unto them, Come and dine. And none of the disciples durst ask him, Who art thou, knowing that it was the Lord? Jesus then cometh and taketh bread, and giveth them, and fish likewise. This is now the third time that Jesus showed himself to his disciples, after that, he was risen from the dead. So when they had dined, Jesus saith to Simon Peter, Simon, son of Jonas, lovest thou me more than these? He saith unto him, Yea, Lord, even as the horn would. Thou knowest that I love thee. He saith unto them, Feed my lambs. Mm -hmm. He saith to him again the second time, Simon, son of Joseph, Joseph, Jonas, lovest thou me? He saith unto him, Yea, Lord. Thou knowest that I love thee. He saith unto him, Feed my sheep. He saith unto him the third time, Simon, son of Jonas, lovest thou me? Peter was grieved because he said unto him the third time, Lovest thou me? And he saith unto him, Lord, thou knowest all things. Thou knowest that I love thee. Jesus saith unto him, Feed my sheep. Verily, verily, I say unto thee, When thou wast young, thou girdest thyself, and walkest whither thou wouldest. But when thou shalt be old, thou shalt stretch forth thy hands, and another shall gird thee, and carry thee whither thou wouldest not. This spake he, signifying by what death he should glorify God. And when he had spoken this, he said unto him, Follow me. Then Peter, turning about, seeth the disciple whom Jesus loving, loved following, which also leaned on his breast to supper, and said, Lord, which is he that betrayeth thee? 
Peter seeth him, saith to Jesus, Lord, and what shall this man do? Jesus saith unto him, If I will that he tarry till I come, what is that to thee? Follow thou me. Then went the saying abroad among the brethren that that disciple should not die. Yet Jesus said not unto him, He shall not die, but if it, I will that he tarry till I come, what is that to thee? This is a disciple which testifies of these things and wrote these things, and we know that his testimony is true. And there are also many other things which Jesus did, the which if they should be written, every one, I suppose that even the world itself could not contain the books that should be written. Amen. Amen. Thank you for the word of God. Mm -hmm. um, what I heard in my spirit as I was reading this is this title called Undone Things. Undone mm -hmm. Things. As we looked at the end of chapter 20, we saw that uh, Jesus was appearing before the disciples, and right at the end, he was with Thomas. And he wanted Thomas to believe. He said, believe, Thomas, believe. At the end of that scripture, it says, blessed are those that don't see, but believe. I believe. And we are that blessed. We are in that blessed place, because we are in a place of not seeing, yet we are believing. Mm -hmm. So we live in that faith place the substance of things hoped for, and the evidence of things not seen. So we are in a crucial, times, crucial time in our lives right now when we may be in a place of waiting, or in a place of deep thought, or in a place of decision. So chapter 21, as we go from there, we're entering into chapter 21, and Jesus is about to appear before his disciples again for the third time. And the scene is that the disciples are at a place, Peter and six other disciples, because there was a total of seven of them. Let me know when it's ending, I'll stop. And um, there's seven of them that are just at a place. You know, they've been in a whirlwind for the last three years, going with Jesus and mm -hmm. uh, traveling around with him and seeing him do miracles and and getting to a place where he had to be crucified and they're alone, you know? And then next thing you know, he's resurrected and he's coming through the walls and coming through the doors and saying, peace be to you. A whirlwind, can you imagine the, how their minds had to be going with all of the things that were going on with them, with Jesus? And now we get to a place where Peter and some of the disciples decided that they're going to go fishing. They decided to go back to their comfortable place. They decided to go back to a place that was familiar to them, a place where they knew what to do, a place that they knew how to do what they had to do. Have you ever found yourself in a familiar place, a comfortable place, a place where you said, you know what, I just want to sit here, and I just don't even feel like moving because it is easy to be in this comfortable place. Mm -hmm. Disciples, they, they knew how to fish. They knew what to do. And, and Peter, even in this aspect, he is a leader. Mm -hmm. He's the leader. He said, I go fishing. And they said, and we go too. <laughs> they wanted to go with him to fish. I thought it was kind of cool because you all know I like numbers because there were seven of them that decided to go. Mm -hmm. Seven, the number of completion. There were some things that needed to be taken care of, even at the end of this chapter, or at John chapter 21. But how did they get to this place? You know, John, the book of John is ending, <clears throat> is different from the three other Gospels. Mm -hmm. The three other Gospels are different, and they're ending. 